Diabetic kidney disease accounts for up to 50% of cases of kidney failure. So that's a lot of diabetic kidney damage. And today's video is about how to improve your diabetic kidney damage, your diabetic nephropathy with an over-the-counter, very safe supplement that has dozens of research, of published, peer-reviewed research on it. So thanks for tuning in. This is Robert Galarowitz. This is our channel at Healthy Kidney Inc. And today we're talking about a really powerful super nutrient called alpha-lipoic acid. That's A-L-A -A for short. And that's alpha lipoic acid. Now, alpha lipoic acid, your body makes a little bit of it. You get some nutrients from a variety of foods like broccoli, potatoes, uh, different vegetables. You can't get enough from food to have a therapeutic effect. So that's why we're talking about it in supplement form. And alpha lipoic acid has been around for, for a long time and it's over the counter and it's shown to do tremendous things when it comes to diabetic kidney disease. And I think everybody that has diabetic kidney disease uh, should probably use it for a period of time and see what results you get. So I'm gonna go through just a couple of journal citations here, peer reviewed research, so that you just see how strong this is and how, you know, how much research is behind it. It's not something new, it's not something that just came out. So we have 2012, Helps Pain Management, Diabetic Nephropathy, that's the Foot and Ankle Specialty Journal, 2012. Uh, the Journal of College of Physicians Surgery, uh, 2019, October, uh, ALA, um, Helps Diabetic Nephropathy. Open Medical Journal, 2017. Journal of Clinic uh, Clinical Laboratory Analysis, 2017. And dozens more, all showing uh, alpha lipoic acid in human trials, human studies, in people. And there's, there's plenty more with pets, uh, with mice, test tubes, rats. But alpha lipoic acid. Now you know about it. Now you know how critical it is for, for diabetic nephropathy, for your kidney health, okay? It's gonna help your blood sugar. And what they really find that it does in kidney disease, it helps lower protein in the urine if, uh, for diabetic nephropathy. It's a powerful antioxidant, so it helps those cells. Uh, and it helps lower inflammation across the board. That's a really big thing. So alpha lipoic acid. You have to pick it up over the counter. At a vitamin store, you can order it online. Now, if you buy alpha lipoic acid, you wanna use 600 milligrams twice a day. That's 600 milligrams twice a day. Morning and night, uh, afternoon and night, you know, whatever your schedule permits, but twice a day. Don't get 300, don't get 100, don't get 50, uh, because it's not gonna work, okay? The studies are pretty clear. Higher dose, the better. And I don't go below 600 twice a day, which is shown in most of the research, and does tremendous good benefits for diabetic nephropathy. Uh, you should definitely give it a try for at least six months. If you use alpha lipoic acid longer than six months, you might have to take some copper with it. Generally, we'll recommend copper um, after six months use of alpha lipoic acid. Take like two milligrams of copper uh, daily, just for about 30 to 60 days, because alpha lipoic acid is a chelator. It pulls metals out of your body. And that's generally a good thing because you want to get uh, heavy metals that you accumulate in your body naturally through the environment, through, uh, through living in a city that has a lot of pollution, through living by a highway, living by any heavily trafficked areas from the pipes that carry water to your house. So you're always exposed to some degree in heavy metals and alpha lipoic acid helps chelate that, but in return it takes out a little bit of copper. So it's recommended if you're going to go more than six months supplementation with alpha lipoic acid, for like 30, 60 days after that six months, uh, do a little bit of copper, two milligrams. Um, and then again, you say you do six months again of alpha lipoic acid, if you're gonna stay on it, then every six months or so, you should do a little bit of copper. But take it, it's great for your kidney health. You have to do something to improve your kidney health. If you leave it up to just the professionals who see you for 15 minutes, don't think about you right after you walk out the door, it's generally not gonna turn out good for you in the long term. Thanks for watching everybody to your best kidney health. Bye.